आउज बिल्लाम बसमीम् अलकुम स्टूडेंट्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस द चैप्टर नंबर फोर प्लूटेंट्स एंड देयर इफेक्ट्स ऑन एनवायरनमेंट द टॉपिक इज ग्लोबल वार्मिंग एंड मॉडल ऑफ ग्रीन हाउस ऑफ क्लास एट मेड बाय मैम सुंदर ओके टुडे अवर मॉरल लेसन इज वॉट मैटर्स मोस्ट इज हाउ यू सी यूर सेल्फ that not matters that how the world uh, knows you it most matter that how you see yourself okay so today our topic is what is global warming so global warming is an expression which refers to the effect of human activities that produce the natural change on the climate the main reason is to increase the global warming or the definition of the global warming we can say that the increase in atmospheric temperature is called the global warming it is an increase in earth's temperature due to burning of fossil fuels coal oil and gas and large scale of deforestation which results in emission of large amounts of greenhouse gases to the atmosphere so now there is a question that now what causes global warming so what are the causes for global warming there are the causes of global warming you can see here the burning of fossil fuels livestock deforestation and according to scientist and government organization concentration of greenhouse gases in the atmosphere due to greenhouse effect is the major cause of global warming these gases especially carbon dioxide have heat trapping capability so they trap heat and cause the greenhouse effect rising global temperature these gases which can uh, which uh, come on earth and cannot go back this is called the greenhouse effect and what is the effect uh, cause of uh, this effect of uh, gases greenhouse gases mainly comprises of carbon dioxide methane and nitrous oxide these gases are lighter than air so they rises up to the outer limits of the earth's atmosphere and settle up there okay they make a layer on the earth making an impenetrable barrier that traps heat from escaping out into the space and keeping it within our environment and increase the temperature when there is a layer outside the earth surface they cover all the um, radiations which are coming from the sunlight and they cannot allow to go back to the um, or outside from the earth which is the main cause of the increasing of temperature of our earth so some of the main causes of global warming are greenhouse effects greenhouse effect is the phenomena in which the heat and light of sun enters to the us atmosphere but cannot go out as they are trapped by the greenhouse gases as a re result temperature rises okay you can see the here that the rays coming from the sun but cannot go back to the atmosphere again so there are numerous effect of global warming which cause the so many effects on our uh, lives so some of the effects of global warming observed across the world wide are rise in sea levels why the sea levels are uh, rises due to rise in temperature the glaciers present in a polar regions are melting rapidly as a result there is a sufficient rise in the sea levels also there are so many effects of uh, global warming for example the melting of glaciers the uh, flooding uh, earthquake and also there are the deaths of animals because of a high heat okay so droughts and floods higher temperature leads to faster evaporation of water and leads to drought in one part and heavy rainfall causes flooding in other part of the world experts have estimated that drought conditions might be increasing by at least 66% in upcoming years boys you uh, students you know that 
the uh, average temperature of the atmosphere has increased from 0.4 to 0.8 degrees centigrade since last century so which caused the main uh, which is the main cause of a global warming if the temperature rise uh, in uh, rapid condition then they can rise the temperature of our earth effects on uh, biodiversity what is the effect of uh, uh, this uh, global warming on the wildlife wildlife researchers have noticed some of the strong species migrating to the poles for north and far south to maintain their needed habitat for example the red fox normally on inhabitant on the earth uh, north america is now seen living in the arctic also it has been noticed that loss of species and endangerment is rising along with the global temperature so what is the main effect of the uh, global warming is badly it is badly affected by global warming by the arctic regions where ha where always the glaciers are present the ice is present and now because of high temperature these gl ice glaciers are being melted so now boys we are going to discuss the model of a greenhouse what is the greenhouse and how can we make it so first of all for making this greenhouse we can make a structure of this greenhouse with the six acrylic square sheets which we are uh, which are uh, 10 inches per side glue sticks soil and plants thermometer tape and so how we can make the now uh, model of a greenhouse first of all we are going to cutting the acrylic squares of the greenhouse base walls and roofs then we are going to glue all these sheets with each other and then we are, are going to confirm that all these sheets are airproof okay and uh, they have roof using tape and fit the structure in a way that it should be airtight okay after that we are going to compare the temperature of outside environment and inside the greenhouse on a sunny day and will record it in their notebooks here you can see that we are going to uh, make the sheets we can fix the sheets with each other and these will be airtight okay now so you can see the different models of uh, greenhouse where we can plant the pla uh, where we can plant the uh, different type of plants in the soil and can compare the temperature of outside and inside environment okay now boys or uh, girls students it is the exercise time first of all we are going to uh, discuss the question number one fill the circle of the correct option against each statement this is not a major air pollutant first mcqs is this is not a major air pollutant first is carbo uh, chlorofluorocarbons carbon dioxide nitrogen and sulfur dioxide so the right answer is carbon dioxide co2 second mcq is the major man-made source for carbon monoxide is smoke arising from vehicles industrial smoke fuel combustion d all of above so right answer is all of the above third mcq is greenhouse gases can be reduced through a plantation of trees using solar energy reducing harmful emissions d is banning the motor vehicles so a is the right answer plantation of trees four mcqs is global warming tends to change in the world a only abiotic factors b animals and plants c weather patterns and d direction of rivers so the right answer is weather patterns now fifth mcqs ozone formation in the atmosphere save us from ultraviolet solar radiations solar light infrared solar radiations or formation of clouds so the answer is a ultraviolet solar radiations now we are going to solve the short questions of your book answer the following questions briefly number one breathing is directly disturbed through air pollution justify the statement 
Now, what is the answer of this question? Breathing is directly disturbed through air pollution because we breathe in air to live and what we breathe has a direct impact on our health. Breathing in polluted uh, air puts us at a high risk for asthma and other respiratory diseases. Air pollution causes coughing, wheezing and irritation of nose and throat. So, all these diseases caused because of the air pollution. So, question number two, what are the effects of chlorofluorocarbons on human lungs? CFCS are the chlorofluorocarbons. So, answer is inhalation of these uh, of chlorofluorocarbons can affect the lungs very badly because it has a carbon which can damage our lungs if it is in a high amount. Okay, now question number third is chlorine converts ozone into oxygen molecule. Explain the statement the answer is the chlorine atom react with oxygen present in the ozone molecule and break the ozone molecule now there is the equation for this cl plus o3 minus makes the o2 plus clo and o2 plus clo make the cl plus o3 minus okay so one chlorine atom can destroy more than one lakh ozone molecules now boys and girls now there is a question number four what is the greenhouse effect answer is greenhouse gases for example carbon dioxide oxide of nitrogen and methane trap the radiation coming from the earth as a result the atmospheric temperature increases that is called the greenhouse effect now we have a last question which is define global warming and we are going to define here answer is the increase in earth's temperature is called global warming the increased amount of carbon dioxide methane and greenhouse gases is the main source of the global warming so boys make it clear and uh, write uh, learn these questions